Tyler Potter is suing his ex-girlfriend, 24-year-old Brittany Johnson, for unpaid rent after she broke their lease. Mr. Potter, you and Ms. Johnson were in a relationship. You signed a lease together on a one-bedroom apartment. Is yes, that correct? Yes, ma'am. The relationship didn't work out, and Ms. Johnson moved out three months prior to the end of the lease. Yes, ma'am. You want her to be responsible for her half of the rent. Mm -hmm. That is correct. For when she moved out. Right. When did you move in? April of 2017. Who were you working for, Ms. Johnson? During the summer, I was in an unpaid full-time internship. Shh, just a second. April of 2017, what kind of work were you doing? Um, I was currently in school. In April, I didn't say what you were currently. What were you doing in April of 2017? I was finishing my degree in, at, in college. And not working? Not working. What were you doing in May of 2017? I started a full-time unpaid internship at a hospital. What were you doing in June and July and August? In an unpaid internship. And in September? I started a job, a full-time job, September 5th of 2017. And when did you move out? Um, February 23rd. 2018. In the month of January of 2018, did you give Mr. Potter any money towards rent? That's either a yes or a no. Yes. How much did you give him? For January of 2018, I would say 644. How much did she give you? Well, she didn't give me money. She I gave it to her. She it. paid it on the mobile app and I transferred 644 into her bank. To, 644. The lease. Right. That was in January. And how much did you give him or pay for rent in December? The same 644 he gave you 644? Um, throughout, yes, believe. I Since, listen to my questions. Within a month of having started your new job in September, that would be starting in October, did you start contributing $644 towards the rent? Not exactly. If I could contribute that amount, I would. I would pay half, but there was never a oral or just, verbal just, just, agreement. I didn't ask you anything else. That's what I'm here to determine. While you were going to school and had an unpaid internship, is it correct, Mr. Potter, that the defendant was not paying rent? Um, yes. Just give me an answer that's truthful. Sure. The answer was yes. And when she started working, she started paying her half of the rent. Yes. Did you pay rent in February? I did. The lease was over in May? May 27th. So your request is that she pay you $644 times three. Correct. Nineteen thirty-two. Did you pay the rent for the entire period until the lease was over? Yes, ma'am, I did. Do you have any information, Ms. Johnson, that Mr. Potter did not pay the rent through the end of the lease? No, he did pay, and as of January 20th, he did say that he would sign me off the lease if that is what I needed to do. You owe him $1,932. Judgment for the plaintiff. We're done. Please excuse me. Step out.